Hey my squidlings, it's Katie here and welcome back to another video. I feel like I haven't uh, talked to you guys in a while. I know that I didn't do a Saturday video. I was sick and I honestly just wasn't feeling like making a video. Um, and I know Monday's video for last week didn't have a voiceover. Um, so I'm really sorry, but today I am kind of uh, making up for that. Um, so I'm actually adding a sketch portion into um, my speed paint. And uh, I really like the way that this turned out, and I'm glad that I'm able to share the uh, sketch portion with you. You can kind of see some of my, like, what I went through to get from point A to point B. Um, and yeah, there's a lot of mistakes, uh, so yeah. But um, I sketched in blue. I initially was going to um, blend these colors into the uh, colored layer. Um, and you may see that in the video. I'm not quite sure if I left that in or not, but, um, I eventually kind of opted out for that and I ended up lining it later. So I colored it first and then lined it later. She's supposed to be kind of a butterfly girl, even though her wings don't really look like butterfly wings. Um, I decided to kind of keep her butterfly-ish. Um, I don't know. It was just fun for me and I really, really love the way this looks. I know I already said that. Um, but anyway, here I am going in with color and I'm just kind of blocking it out. My sketch layer is super transparent and I'm just kind of coloring over it. Um, and then, uh, I will add the shading later in a clipping group, but I don't do that until later. Um, actually, no, I take the back. I do that right now. Um, and then I do blend it with a blur tool. Um, I'm trying, I really want my digital art to be, um, a little bit more loose than my traditional art. Um, so I'm trying to go in that direction with it. So bear with me. My digital art's probably going to be very rocky for the next however long it takes. Um, but, uh, I'm trying to think of what I could talk about. I'm sorry. It feels like I haven't done this in forever. Um, but yeah, I just kind of blocked in the shading. You'll see that the sketch layer kind of pops in and out so I can make sure that it looks okay without the lines because again, the lines are not going to be there. I tried to color her in like a monarch butterfly color scheme. So like browns and oranges and white, um, because again, I wanted her to be a butterfly and, uh, yeah. And then I added some strands of hair to make it look all flowy and stuff. Yes, she has antenna on her head. Um, I thought it would be kind of fun. I don't know. I just wanted to do something different. And, uh, if you can't tell, I've been really into drawing these character busts lately. And, uh, I don't know what it is about them. It's just really fun for me and it's good practice. So, uh, I guess it's, you know, bonus. If you ever want to know when I'm not going to be posting a video, like this weekend, um, please follow me on Twitter. I keep my updates there. I kind of let you guys know if I plan on uploading a video or not uh, via there. Um, and you get sneak peeks and stuff, so it's bonus. Um, but yeah, so I'm blocking the shading for her hair now, and I wanted it to be super messy. I I uh, just kind of want it to be like implied shading and uh, that's kind of what I was going for in this picture in general. Um, I'm happy with it. It's not 100% amazing, but I'm relatively happy with it. Uh, you know, it could be better um, and that's what practice is for, but I'm happy with it. I said that like 87 times, but anyway, I'm still slightly recovering from uh, my cold and oh yeah, this is where I go in with that brown liner. Anyway, um, thank you for everybody that hoped I felt better, and, uh, I really appreciate your sweet comments. Um, thankfully, the worst is over. I hate being sick. I think everybody does, but I just absolutely hate it. I feel like a big baby. I am a big baby. Um, but I think my stuffy nose, you may or may not be able to tell if I have a stuffy nose or not, but it's almost gone. I'm so sick of blowing my nose. <laughs> So, anyway, I'm pretty sure you did not get on this video to hear me talk about me blowing my nose. Um, so anyway, yeah, I decided to line everything in brown just because I thought it fit well. Um, and then now I'm coloring in her tattoos. They're supposed to be peonies, but they're, like, really, um, impressionistic, I guess. Uh, they're not, like, super good or anything, so... Um, I was going to outline it in black, and then I was just like, no, that looks really bad. So, I took all that off and just left it. 
on the now eye and working on her wings and that's basically the last part uh, it's basically over I add a few little details like dots and stuff but other than that it's done um, and then I well of course I go into her eye and I color all that stuff I forgot about that <laughs> um, and then yeah I think that's it um, I do add a little circle background too to make it kind of finished ish I don't know but anyway uh, I really hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did don't forget to thumbs it up also don't forget you can follow me on all of my social media and you can support my channel links are down in the description below um, and yeah don't forget to subscribe to join our cute little squid pod if you haven't already to keep updated on new videos and stuff and until next time guys toodaloo